to <laughs> Okay, what am I supposed to say? It's definitely giving what it's supposed to get. Period. And if you want this look, stay tuned. Because we gave you what we supposed to have given in this install. It's it giving Beyonce no plumber. <laughs> <laughs> she can't stay out of the camera, y'all. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's giving. I, big hair is, 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 is giving it's energy for me. Mm. The camera ain't sat down yet. What y'all waiting on to book my friend? Like, Let's go. Take, take off. You got your hair down there. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, getting right into the mojo. Okay, you're gonna need your stocking cap and your black strips. I like to use the mega black strips because they're larger. Um, also, um, I feel like I get a, uh, a bit of stretch with those as well. So it typically takes me about two and then I put the um, stocking cap over it. Now the reason for um, the tucking is to make sure that the braids are secured with the paper around them around the perimeter of it because i want to take that first track and place it right up on it so you're going to see that in just a few minutes but i also like to sew down my cap just for longevity um you know it's always good to secure the quick weave especially when you're using this this method because if you just glue it sometimes if you sweat in your head or if um the glue is not secured properly then it can come off like a wig so yeah you want to make sure you secure it with the thread in my personal opinion you can and don't have to but i just prefer to because that's just my technique but um i'm gonna go over with the got to be glue spray you can use the even spray i've been liking that spray a lot lately too as well so either one you can get your hands on you want to spray it really really good and coat it well and you're gonna place your client under the dryer not long since it's hairspray so um, these are loose deep bundles as I mentioned earlier in the video um, we're going for a big and messy look so I am gonna disturb the curves curls just a little bit so we're gonna jump right in y'all I cut that extra cap off and now it's time to lay tracks so I am gonna show you that I'm gonna lay that first track from temple to temple and as I mentioned earlier I'm gonna lay it right at the bottom of that braid as you can see where that cap is hitting I'm gonna lay that first trap from temple to temple and I'm gonna follow as such. So you guys just keep watching, stay tuned for the finished product. Um, you definitely gonna wanna see the placement of the tracks in the front. Friend got her wine, honey, so. And yes, she's of age to be drinking. But yeah, I'll take a little pump it up as well just to help secure the um, track down faster because it just makes it hold fast, adhere faster when you put a little hairspray or a little spritz on the actual cap before you place the glue in the tray down but you just want to take your blow dry dry as you go and um you want to follow suit so i'm not gonna talk too much i'm gonna just let you guys watch and learn and be sure to stay tuned to the finished results Ah, ah, don't get 
ਨਿਕਲ ਗਏ As you can see we have made it to the top and this is the area where you are going to do the flip over energy so um depending upon which way that person want that flip to fall now you can do the flip over method um like ivy powell normally does it where you can flip both ways and in this case you can but she wanted her flip to go a particular way so we added the volume to go towards that particular side so if you pay attention to what i did then you can get the same exact look and you just want to take those pieces and you want to cut them to size to fit right into that area and you're just gonna cut glue cut glue cut glue you can cut several strips and then glue it's totally up to you but you definitely want to make sure you secure it in place and blow dry it well because this is going to be the area that's going to be tossed and played with the most so you want to make sure you secure those tracks and um fairly close as well you know just to make sure you don't see no gaps and no cap so I'm just going to do that throughout this entire, well, throughout the rest of the video. Um, and as you can see, the side that I'm flipping on is the side, the, the side that I'm flipping away from is the side that I'm taking the tracks upwards on. So pay attention and you can do it. So stay tuned.
when wand curling the natural hair, you do want to grab some of the extension and mix it with the natural hair as you curl. And then once you finish doing that, you want to go in the the weave or should I say the extensions um, and curl some of that as well so that it all blends. And then, of course, towards the end of the video, you'll see us fluff it a little bit to give it more of a natural look because she's going for the messy wild look not neat and pretty and perfect look so um depending on how you want those curls to look you can actually one curl the entire head or you could leave it as is it's totally up to you but um right now i'm just taking small pieces and i'm one curling it to fit the look so just continue watching guys i want to let you just you know catch the wave and enjoy the moments don't forget to catch the bloopers and the vibes at the end. LWT gang, we lit. Roll to 100K. Okay, so typically I would do got to be glued on the edges um, only because most people want the edges to last and um, stay in place for a while. But um, my friend Q, she knows how to touch her baby hairs up. So, of course, we went for the hairspray baby hairs, which give a more of a soft hold. Like, it looks hard, but it's actually kind of soft. Um, so... And we was going for the, you know, extra baby hairs like Jada. They be thick and big. So, it was definitely giving the Jada vibes on the um, baby hairs. But, yeah, you typically just spray your brush, put a little hairspray on it. And then, of course, the blow dryer is key. You want to go ahead and dry it in place, especially if you're natural. You don't want it to curl back up. But, yeah, so this is pretty much the final look. As you can see, we're putting the hoops on, baby. And I'm taking a little bit of that Fantasia Spritz and put it on that leave out um, just to give it a little extra hold. But, baby, the look is here. The look is here. I'm going to stop talking and just keep tuning in because, yeah, we gave y'all all the vibes. Ooh, slow-mo. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done.
supposed to say. It's definitely giving what it's supposed to gain. Period. And if you want this look.